Hello, my name is Jerry Maslenki. Today I would like to talk to you about the importance of hmm, hair analysis. What is it? What it is, hair analysis? What is the purpose it is serving? Hair analysis was developed many decades ago by the most famous, most recognized physicians and biochemists. The purpose of hair analysis is for the reason to look deep into the body, right into the cells. We want to see by checking the soft tissue, which is the hair, we want to see what's happening deep inside the body. Blood work, checking the blood, it won't, won't tell us anything in that case. Blood work will show us only some elements, some chemicals, some substances which are circulating in the blood in this very moment. But we want to see what's happening inside our body for at least months. What causes the disease? What is going on inside of us? We want to prevent diseases. We want to assist in the treatment from the point of view of each individual since everybody is different. The hair will tell us exactly what's happening inside of us. By checking the hair, we're looking upon specifically minerals, so-called good and bad minerals. The bad one, I mean heavy metals, which we are loaded today because of the environment. We want to see the catalyzers of every biochemical process. Without minerals, we cannot uh, expect anything right inside of our bodies. We want to see the balance or lack of the balance, which is leading immediately, directly into disease. Those people who were working on it, they find out that minerals, they have to be in a proper balance. For example, zinc must be in the balance with copper, since copper, for example, is working with progesterone. Without copper, there wouldn't be progesterone. Without zinc, there wouldn't be, uh, sorry, vice versa. Zinc, it's a pro progesterone. Copper, we mean estrogen. If there is no balance between these two, we might expect some uh, uh, lack of balance uh, uh, between those two hormones. This is a typical example. How important it is to look into the body and check the minerals, the catalyzers of biochemical processes which are taking place in our body every split of a second. That's why it is important, whether we're talking about prevention or assistance in the treatment of disease already present, to check upon what do we really have inside. Do we have too much of something or are we lacking something? It is important to bring the balance back and then we can talk about a proper approach to our body in a very humble way. 
we need to treat our bodies in a very humble way. That's why I insist on everybody who wants to avoid disease or to treat the disease in a proper manner, the way accordingly to our body demand is to check upon what, in, what it's inside every cell and as soon as possible bring the balance accordingly. Thank you very much.